Oh right, this whole thing is about self-acceptance? So I should just stop judging and accept? So no matter what I do, hooray for me because I'm a great guy? It's all good. No matter how many dogs I kill, I should just, what, do an inventory and accept? I mean, you back your truck over your own kid and you're like, accept? What a load of crap! You know what? Why I'm here in the first place is to sell you meth. You're nothing to me but customers. I made you my bitch. You okay with that? You accept? About time. Come with me to Oxford. What? I want you to come with me. You sure about that? Oh yeah. Yeah, but how do you know that? I don't know, I just know. Yeah, but how do you know? I know because I feel it. Because that's a really serious thing you're saying. I mean, you could be in Oxford next week and you know, you might find out something about me that you don't like. And you know, maybe you wish you hadn't said that. But you know, it's such a serious thing that you can't take it back and now I'm stuck in Oxford with somebody who doesn't really want to be with me that just wish they had a take back. What's a take back? I don't want a take back, I just want you to come to Oxford with me. I can't go to Oxford. Well, why not? One, because I have a job here and two, because I live here. Look, if you don't love me, you should just tell me. I'm not saying I don't love you. Then why? Why don't you come? What are you so scared of? What am I so scared of? Well, what aren't you scared of? You live in this safe little world where no one challenges you and you're scared shit that's well, tell me about my. Don't tell me about my world. I mean, you just want to have your little fling like with the guy from the other side of town. Then you're going to go off to Oxford, you're going to marry some rich prick who your parents will approve of, and just sit around like the other trust fund babies and talk about how you went slumming too once. Why are you saying this? What is your obsession with this money? My father died when I was 13 and I inherited this money. You don't think every day I, I wake up and I wish I could give it back, that I wouldn't give it back in a second if it meant I could have one more day with him. But I can't and that's my life and I deal with it. So don't go putting your shit on me when you're the one that's afraid. I'm afraid of, what am I afraid of? What the fuck am I afraid of? You're afraid of me. You're afraid that I won't love you back. And you know what? I'm afraid too. But fuck it, I wanna give it a shot then at least I'm honest with you. I'm not honest with you. No, what about your 12 brothers? You're not going! What do you want to know? What, that I don't have 12 brothers? That I'm a fucking orphan? I didn't know that. No, you don't want to hear that. You don't want to hear that I got cigarettes put out on me when I was a little kid. I didn't know that. That this isn't fucking surgery, that the motherfucker stabbed me. You don't want to hear that shit, Skylar. I want to hear it because I want to help you, because I want to be with you. Help me? What the fuck? What do I got? A fucking sign on my back that says save me. Do I look like I need that? No. I love you. Don't bullshit me. Don't fucking bullshit me. I love you. And I want to hear you say that you don't love me because if you say that, I won't call you. And I won't be in your life. I don't love you.